in Top Solid 2017 is a command called matrix. It's a new surfacing command. Now here what we're going to do is we're starting by editing our sketch to kind of prepare things for the matrix command. And all I'm doing is dividing up what was a single segment into multiple segments just to show really how far we can go with this new command. Now, as I'm dimensioning this, I want to kind of explain what matrix is for. It's for creating complex surfaces for use with wire EDM or for use with die design or things like that. So now we have everything set the way we want. Let's try it all out. So we'll go to the surface tab and choose the matrix command. Now right off the bat, it just looks like a simple face wet that we're adding taper to, right? But let's play with this a little bit. Let's see what kind of choices we have. Of course, we want 10 degrees draft here, six degrees, who knows, right? Now, how do we want corners to work? Maybe I want conical filleting. Look at the sharp corners and we're getting conical filleting. Maybe at this segment, I want to do something different, like change the draft angle. Why not? Let's give that four degrees. Cool. Let's go here and change again. That's six degrees. But notice what the software did in between them. It's kind of cool. It added a face. Oh, we want to change the transition to just be linear from one to the other. Let's make that seven degrees. Nice. Let's go to the next one on this segment. And now what do we want to do? In this segment, we can make the change there to seven degrees. And you see how it affects everything downstream. We're back to six degrees. Let's change the method to be a simple blend. I want the start to be at seven. I want the end to be at six. Cool. All of this is ridiculously complex to deal with if you had to do it manually. Thankfully, top solid has the right solution at the right time. Here I just picked on a vertex and I can change how I want to modify that vertex. Do I want a conical blend? Do I want a linear blend? What? I want it back to sharp. You always have a choice. Let's see what we can do over here. Here, I don't want it conical. Here, I want it to be linear. Here, I want to change the draft angle again. Why not? Segment by segment, step by step, you are in full control over the profile, over the taper, and everything else that goes along with it. Think about how simple this is and how much time you would have spent using manual solutions.